The COVID-19 pandemic has affected everyone all around the globe, be it the elderly, the people in jobs, and especially the children. Good mental health during the childhood is very important for achieving developmental milestones. It helps children with their emotional well-being and social skills. In addition, mentally healthy children function well at home, in their schools, in their communities, and have greater chances of leading happy and successful life. On the contrary, poor mental health of children can severely impact the way children learn, behave, and handle their emotions. The COVID-19 pandemic has brought many complex challenges which had mental health repercussions on everyone, including children and adolescents. Grief, fear, uncertainty, social isolation, increased screen time, and parental fatigue has negatively affected the mental health of the children. It is not unusual for children to have negative emotions, but this prolonged, restrictive and widespread nature of the pandemic has worsened the situation. Children aren't able to indulge in creative activities like playing or socializing, which can help them express or communicate any negative feelings. The absence of a structured setting of a school for a long duration results in disruption in routine, boredom, lack of innovative ideas for engaging in various academic and extracurricular activities. WHO or World Health Organization has helped parents tackle the problem of mental health of their children. The Government of India, with the help of National Institute of Mental Health and Neuroscience, has provided guidelines for the parents for the health of their children during the lockdown. Some of them are providing assurance when the child needs, keeping them in contact with their friends, managing the anxiety of the child, giving them clear information about what's happening in the world, engaging them in indoor activities like puzzles and games, making a routine of learning at home like giving them small assignments. The most dangerous bit about this pandemic hasn't been the virus. The most dangerous part has been the time spent in fear of it, the helplessness, the isolation, the uncertainties. Our lives were disrupted in manner we may never be able to set right again. Sooner or later, the pandemic will pass, but the toll it took on all of us will remain.